Shatawale endorses President Akufo Addo for 2020 elections. He said to have made the statement or this endorsement when he spoke to George Kwaye on Joy FM. According to him, the president deserves another shot at being president of Ghana for four more years because he has done a lot of laudable um, things during his first tenure in office. He also made reference to the way he has handled the pandemic and um, says that that is enough for him to and does him for another four years. I mean, I, I, using the entertainment industry and mixing it with politics always brings like an interesting stare to, mm. to the mix and everything. I, I don't I don't remember much about um, Ghana, Ghana's politics now, but I know that um, the two parties, NPP and NC, let's just say, more, more, yeah. um, <laughs> let's use the president's names, um, um, Nana's party and Ma 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 well, I forgot how to say his name, the ex-president. I think those those two parties are like the uh, PDP and APC. APC. Mm -hmm. And I, for the longest time, I thought Shatawale, I think he's still part of, yeah, he, he's associated still to that other part party. of the opposing party, but he's saying that if someone is doing the job, yeah. then let the person do the job. I don't know. So this doesn't mean that he's now part of President Nana's um, party. Yeah, 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 and I understand what he says that, but I think that's, in my opinion, I think that's very naive. You can't vote a person to power. You vote the party to power. It's mm. like marrying, saying that it's just the person. Like, except you're going to move out of the country and mm. live alone with that person. You're marrying their family as well. That's kind of like how that works. So it was very interesting. I want to, I, this is one of those things where I want to see how the party is responding to that because you can't just say, oh yeah, I like Obama. Now, Obama comes with the Democratic. So if you're a conservative, as much as you like Obama, it'd be really weird to see a conservative, like, you know, endorsing Obama and things like that. But I understand that it's tricky and he's a musician, but so I'm not expecting like him to have it's, like... Like you said, it's tricky. And this is Africa where we don't even know if embracing the party is the way to go now because we've seen mm. a lot of dramas. And you could see sometimes that this candidate is worthy of giving of being given an opportunity but the party itself yeah, is yeah, you know so yeah. it's, it's it's really dicey when it yeah. comes to this part of the world i i don't i don't know how that makes me feel but i'm but sure Nana will be happy from, yeah of course it will news from ghana though like at, at least those i relate with they actually have the opinion that he's done well yeah so um if that's the case then yeah. we'll see how this general election will play out mm. and we'll also like to see how what the measures would be regarding social distancing yeah. and election. I because mean. I think that's what, something that has really helped his tenure is how he's handled um, the coronavirus era. So I, th I don't think he should then falter when it now comes to elections and throw everything out the window. Mm. Um, but so far, so good. I remember we talked about how he um, did really well and then he made a mistake to call too early. And then uh, even now, again, it's back in the news that they're still trying to curb it. And doing really well with them I, avoiding I not community try sharing. To globally. But no, I, I would like to say Nigeria is trying to avoid community sharing. I don't think so. <laughs> I don't think so. <laughs>